Alright, hey YouTube, it's J Dust and I'm here with a friend today. Hi, I'm Imora. Alright, so obviously we have a girl in the house, so let's talk about that. What's it like being a girl on Xbox Live? Well, it's pretty frustrating at times because there's two sides of guys on Xbox. There's ones that love it and there's ones that hate it. And then there's the creepers who just want to hit on me, so it's pretty frustrating sometimes. Alright, and what uh, do your friends know about this kind of stuff in real life, or do you tend not to tell them about it? Well, I I have no problem admitting it, but if guys start to get like really rude about it, I'm not gonna like tell them information they don't need to know. I mean, I have girl friends that play, so that's good. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, so why don't you tell us a little bit about your name? Where did that come from? Um, well, Iroma is uh, Amore Backwards, which is love in Italian, and I actually lived there for 10 years. So if you guys speak Italian, let me know. I'm probably going to do a commentary in Italian for you guys. I can't wait to hear that. That's going to be interesting to see. Alright, so let's talk about Reach. Now, I know you usually play Call of Duty, so what do you think of Reach, personally? Do you like it? Um... Well, in the video right now, this is actually only my second time playing, and I actually don't do too bad, which I mean is good. I like Reach. I prefer COD because, I don't know, I'm just not into like the whole robot futuristic thing, but I mean it's fun, it's not a bad game. Alright, and uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about how you got into COD? Well, I have so many more guy friends and girlfriends that honestly... Ever since I was little, I kind of just always been this way, and I heard about COD one day, and I was like, why not? So, I tried it, and here I am today, still playing it. Alright, that's cool. And, uh, so you play Black Ops, what level are you right now? Um, around 30, first prestige. So, yeah, I, I mean, it's only been out for a month, and I'm pretty busy with school, so that's why I'm not really too high level yet. Yeah, no, I know. I'm flying to college still, too. Alright, well, let's get to the gameplay. Right now, we're playing Slayer on Boardwalk. It was a game of Team Slayer. I don't know, we played this about a month back. And right now, you're using, what is it, Jetpack, and I'm using Armor Lock, because I'm, well, I end up going for the perfection here, which is pretty cool. And uh, I tried not, I tried my best not to do too much camping. Uh, which is ironic compared to the shotgun, but here you go. Yeah, I think I get a firebird in this one. Um, I, I don't actually... Oh, no, that's the assist. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I actually don't get why people don't like firebird. I mean, I don't know, I've heard a lot of people that that's like, oh, it's so newbie. Honestly, you can get some pretty sick kills with it. Like, right here, I think you get it, like, a couple, so that's good. I oh, know, like this blind fire snipe right there for the sniper spree. How about them apples? <laughs> I think though you got a triple. No, 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 not yet. That comes later. And right here, you see a little bit of our teamwork. I weaken that guy, and then you come in with your jetpack and you turn around and take him out. I think we were actually playing dual screen in this one. Yeah, we were we were on split screen yeah, right here. So there you see, I got the assist, and uh, we did a lot of teamwork throughout this game. And there you see this guy ambushes me with jetpack, which just like proves your point about how jetpack right. can be really strategic. And I tried not to use armor lock in that really annoying way where you can just tap it and avoid like getting killed. And this was probably the closest I came to dying when I missed that shotgun shot. Right. Oh, I think um, here I go ahead and die. Go ahead. Oh yeah, that's because, because you were playing COD and you were playing right. too aggressive because you, your shields were down and you were still shooting at that guy. But I got the call out and Wesley. Snipes! Ah, <laughs> little Russian badger right there for you guys. If you don't know who that is, go and check him out. He's awesome, he does Battlefield Bad Company too. But let's talk a little bit more about what you're gonna do. Are you gonna be making more videos or Um yeah, I actually like just uh plan on doing a few commentaries. I have a few COD gameplays I wanna do. I think I go fifty six and thirteen and twenty one and one. So yeah, and here as you can see by the gameplay I think I die soon. And that's because I'm used to the COD gameplay, which I am used to long ranging with uh, guns and co and Halo. You can't do that because I don't know the, the guns aren't really for spraying. I guess I don't know. I, they they function differently than COD. 
Alright, yeah, because you, you generally tend to stick to an hello double kill. Let's get some. <laughs> you generally s just stick to the assault rifle and the pistol for most of this game, and the pistol is like kind of medium range, but it's not that long range. But, you, you know, it does, obviously, it takes more bullets to kill in Halo, so it's, it's right. definitely different. Right, in COD, maybe two, three bullets with hard end and you're dead. And it's definitely, yeah. the maps are way smaller than there this. Like, here there, you go. There you see another little firebird shot. And, and there, nice. I pick up another snipe off that, and that. But there you see that teamwork, and there I kill that random bad kid for the running riot. I you spray that kid down. <laughs> nice. As you can see, I'm a sprayer. <laughs> yeah, she just does tend to. Uh, <laughs> I rush and spray. Yeah, she does definitely not do anything close to camping, so, I mean, you can't really complain. Alright. Yeah. There you go, some firebird. So what was your KD in, uh, let's see, uh, Modern Warfare 2? Um, at the beginning I wasn't good. <laughs> So it's only about 1.2, but in Black Ops it ranges from like 1.5 depending on the game type. Like usually, um, I go way higher than that. As I said, I have gameplays of about like 56 and 13, but it's just overall at the beginning of the game I'm obviously not as good as I'm sure you were with Halo. Yeah, like, okay right here, you see a nice triple kill. Double right through the plant. Couldn't even see that guy. That's a triple kill. That's a nice clip. You're probably gonna see that in the montage later. No, yeah, that's really nice. That was pretty sexy. But right now in Reach, I'm holding, I believe it's a 1.25 KD, give or take, because right. I've been getting a little frustrated. And there, I get another double kill for the rampage. There's another the firebird. Another firebird. Another firebird by Aroma, and. You know, it sounds like your name is like aroma, like the like, smell. Oh, yeah, it does. It's kind of funny. Well, I mean, if you were Italian, you would get it. <laughs> oh, maybe. <laughs> and here she suffers uh, another little oh, embarrassing I death. Get kind. A kill. She almost gets that guy, but she gets the assist on the other guy. I'm used to command, though. Yeah. <laughs> so that doesn't work. But she gives me the call out here. I crouch down and get this guy through the little crack between the windows and get the beast bullet for my 15 sniper kill. Which is pretty awesome. I'm loving those new medals that they put in. They're really cool. Some of them, like, I got an assist free in one game. That was just oh, sure. really cool to get. Yeah, Black Ops has a lot of uh, new medals and customization, which is kind of like Halo, where you can customize your guy, which I think they actually took it from you guys. So that's good. I think I get the kill here. Alright, well guys, the gameplay is wrapping up right about here. I went 23-0. And I went 10 of 5. With 3 assists, so that's not that bad. So check out the link in the description. Rate, comment, sub, and uh, see you guys later. See ya.